A vacant apartment building in northeast Indianapolis has become way too familiar to city firefighters. Yeah, our Steve Brown reports this complex has seen multiple fires, including two in the last two months. We could only confirm one canine inhabitant in an otherwise vacant apartment complex on Roselawn Drive that's become a headache for neighbors and city government. It's clear the complex has become an illegal dumping ground. Trey Wright comes to the neighboring park to walk his dogs and notes the piling trash has gotten worse in the last three years. Of course, you know, the city should be regulating it better to, hey, you need to do something with your property. What the city has been doing here is putting out fires. Yesterday was the second in two months. Fighting the fire yesterday meant also fighting trash dumped on the property that prevented the movement of fire equipment closer to the fire, requiring firefighters to carry equipment and hoses longer distances in the July heat. We end up with five firefighters who overheat. One of them fell through the floor, was taken to the hospital. He's gonna make a full recovery, but it is, it is a lot frustrating, but it's just kind of one of those things that we deal with on a daily basis. Yesterday's fire may have been started by a person or persons illegally living here. A spokesman for the city's Business and Neighborhood Services Department tells us since 2021 alone, the department boarded up this complex 43 times. It has also spent over $8,000 on expansive cleanup efforts to clear the property of trash. There was another trash removal effort after yesterday's fire and today some evidence of new dumping. The city has petitioned to get the property demolished, but the hearing doesn't take place until the end of August. Until then, efforts to resecure the buildings and clear dump trash will continue. In Indianapolis, Steve Brown, Fox 59 News.